My name is Diane, and this is my aha moment. I was born with glaucoma. I had light perception as a child. In 1984, four days before a cornea transplant, with glaucoma, you do have a bubble on your on your eye. That exploded, and when it did, it fell back to my eye, and it uh, basically uh, rotted out the retina. So now I see nothing. But I do have a very vivid imagination. I was visiting somebody in uh, in the country part of uh, Texas, and um, the lady asked me if I knew how to quilt. There was one on the back of the couch, and I said, no, would you like to? Yes. And after 12 and a half years, I'm up to 700 quilts. Being the only well-known totally blind quilter is an honor, and not being able to see the colors, but feeling with uh, your hands as you hand stitch and sewing on the sewing machine is yes, can be a challenge. No, I don't prick my finger all the time like a lot of people think you do. What's amazing to me is that people from around the world want a quilt that I have personally handmade. This is for a young lady that got married last August and she's expecting July 4th. So that's what she wanted was purple on the back with bright butterflies, uh, purple on the front with bright butterflies. And then this is the back. A lot of times when you lose a child, a husband, a, a limb, your eyesight, you are allowed to grieve, but you eventually have to get up and take, get your bootstraps and get up and go on with life because you're still living, you're still breathing. You're allowed to be down today, but you can't be tomorrow because it's a brand new day. New day, new opportunities.